Hi everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. I'm Felicity and today we are starting my brand new Let's Play featuring the Morrisons. And this is going to be my four rent Let's Play. I know what y'all are thinking, okay? Girl, you are like a whole two three weeks late y'all don't fault me okay you cannot rush greatness it's okay because we here and i'm so excited because i've been really planning for this let's play for a really long time and i'm going to introduce you guys to the morrisons and the sims that are going to be in this let's play Bubble this is zanaya jones you guys so she is a bad. goofball she loves the outdoors she's it's coming bad. and she's also Ready? very Little nosy blah, blah. This is a Yoki. She is nosy, generous, a snob, family oriented, and she's also a perfectionist. So Zanea is actually FaceTiming her best friend right now. I don't know who Jade Rosa is, but she is FaceTiming her best friend right now because her and her mom did recently, literally yesterday um they came in to tomarang and zanea was not so happy about moving over here and really like leaving her best friend over where she used to live and so it kind of just left her on a more a sad feeling about moving instead of a happy feeling and also i don't want to ever forget my cute little doggy <laughs> Um, this is Nyla, y'all. She is so adorable. Look at her. They had to move here because, um, Aoki got a job opportunity, like more like a, yeah, basically a job opportunity to oh. become a real estate agent and to own this apartment right here. This apartment is so, 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 so beautiful. And I'm going to show you all around but let's just take in how beautiful tomarang is like this is a really really beautiful world like look at the water like all of the houses and it's just like the scenery here is just so beautiful like i have to take a screenshot because like why is it so beautiful like oh my god it's just so gorgeous Ayoki also did want to move over here because her family actually lives over here and she wants to be closer to her family Ooh. she feels like when she's away from them she Come doesn't in. like she doesn't feel like herself at all so she really wanted to move closer to her family and she got this job opportunity which she's really been into real estate for a while and so when she got this opportunity it was like the best thing ever so this is her mom isla and this is her dad charles and then she also has her um this is her aunt and then this is her cousin which is courtney's um son michael and then this is her uncle Dechi. and you guys can probably see we have some other relationships so we have our let's just start with um zanea's dad so zanea's dad is xavier jones and so that's why she's zanea jones um even though this let's play is called the morrisons um i mean it's because let's be for real ayogi is the you know the mom of the household so it's called the morrisons because her last name is morrison and i'm gonna actually have her go and eat something because she is pretty hungry right now i'm gonna just have her use the toaster and grab her brown sugar pop tart <laughs> so she's gonna grab that and so um she zanea is also very like upset about moving is because she has to she had to move away from her father her and her father have like such an amazing relationship like where they would go to the basketball courts every single saturday and play some basketball he would always take her out to the fair take her out for like lunch you know father daughter times like all the time and honestly like moving over here i feel like it really has a negative impact on Zanea and I feel like it's gonna make her start doing things that she's not supposed to do as in like rebel one person that really is making her the most sad about having to leave is her best friend Naomi which you guys did see in the beginning 
Um, you know, we have a lot of pictures of her. We also have our picture of our dog, Nyla. But we have pictures of our best friends all on our walls. We just FaceTimed her, but I'm going to actually have her go and watch a little bit of TV. Honestly, we moved to the whole other side of the world. And that is not easy for anybody, especially when you have history in your hometown. But you know, Aoki needed this job opportunity because she felt like it was going to be a benefit for her. She's also working on a news article right now um, about her beginnings in Tomarang. But um, yeah, so she just wanted to be also close to family and she feels like family is very, very important. She even left her fiance, which says a lot. And so it's Xavier and her also do have a pretty like weird relationship where he was the one that cheated on her. He cheated on Aoki when, when they were both in high school. And um, he still tries to like be in her life somehow. You know how the, the baby daddies be y'all, okay? They be a little crying, crying, okay? About their baby moms. So you can imagine the relationship between Xavier and Elijah. But Elijah is a, such a like, like a laid back guy. He really just doesn't care about the drama and stuff. He's really just very obsessed with Aoki and really wants to just make her happy and do anything that's going to make her happy. Um, but we're gonna go and oh, what is she doing with Nyla? Oh, oh my god, I love them already. Like, why are they so cute? We do have some other Sims in here, which y'all will see them in a little bit and whatnot. I'm really like happy for Aoki because this is literally her dream, as you can see. This is her dream to be a five star property owner. Her knees are so bad right now, okay. So we're just gonna have her um, also use the toaster and just grab her a little peanut butter and jelly sandwich so she can just eat something very quick. And then um, of course she has to use her daughter's bathroom. But we're gonna go wash her hands. Oh, I mean she can just wash her hands in here. I'm also sorry if the first episode is kind of all over the place. This is literally how first episodes be because it's just like introductions and really getting into the backstory and stuff. We're gonna set these. I remember that um, with the new update, we can actually set the sinks now. So we're going to do that. Like this was such a must need. Like I think everyone can agree in the Sims community that that was such an amazing addition. That basically did leave um, Aoki and Zenea having a little rocky relationship. Um, who was calling us? Oh my god, let's go light fireworks at the... No, they are not as close at all. Like, look at their relationship. They're not as close whatsoever. Um, but let's go back to Aoki. I want to show you guys um, their little relationship. So, yes, they are engaged. Which is kind of like, like, girl. Kind of like you engaged and you really just left your man for a job opportunity. You could have got a job opportunity somewhere else. But, like, at the same time, it's really just money. Like, money could really like change a person and it really is feeling like it's changing aoki she really left her man for this job opportunity um, i don't know when their wedding is gonna be because of the long distance but they do have a long distance love it says distance may separate aoki and elijah physically but their love knows knows no bounds across miles and time zones they maintain a deep connection through letters calls and virtual embraces so yes and they all are also so many so they're really locked in for real and um obviously she finds him very attractive her sentiments about elijah is deeply connected and you're my jam oh that's so cute so many feelings can fit in a small jar giving it to elijah making makes aoki's heart flutter um and his sentiments about her is that he feels close to aoki from good times and happy memories and they are deeply connected and oh fantastic gift because we gave her some gifts and stuff that is a little bit more about her relationship with um elijah of course that she misses him so much and i'm pretty sure he um misses her very much as well so i feel like we're definitely going to visit him very soon probably like tomorrow even though we kind of just got here we're gonna say like the the sims days is a little bit longer okay <laughs> let's just say it's a little bit longer so it's not gonna be like so realistic i guess but it's still you know something honestly i don't think that 
Zanea will ever really forgive her mom for doing what she did. Her mom kind of put herself before anyone else, literally. It's but we're going to FaceTime <laughs> um, Elijah and just tell him that we're here and stuff and just have a little conversation with him. Oh, I also want to show you guys the apartment. <laughs> I've been talking so much and trying to get into like the story and everything that I totally forgot. So when you come in, we are greeted with a lot of stuff. Okay. Okay. So when you go to the left, um, we have our uh, laundry stuff. It's really just in this like little area right here. Oh my god, I just realized we have a laundry stuff and we literally have a laundry thing out there. But anyways, just, just don't mind that, okay? So we walk in and we have a little area right here. We have all of our sweaters, jackets, bags, and some, you know, leashes for Nyla. And then we also have this board right here, a little eraser board, our luggage as well. Um, and then over here we have the kitchen area. And then right over here we have the living room. Um, we have a little dining table right here. It's very small, but it's still super cute. Um, and then we have our balcony right here. It's not too much on here because I don't want it to be too cluttered. Um, but yeah, we have a little yoga mat because uh, Aoki loves meditation. She loves meditation. Um, so this is her bedroom. It is very, very nice. I really like it a lot. I might change a little bit of stuff around. Also, when we get more selfies and stuff, I will add some more things over there. And so over here, we have her tote bag. Um, we got her little makeups and some lotions, which are functional. Um, and then we also have a... Um, little section right here and we also have a picture of them when they went on vacation and then over here we have her bathroom uh, it's very messy but still really cute they are still unpacking a lot of their things y'all so just be a little patient with the way things are looking okay um and then over here is my girl this is my favorite room of like oh my god i wish like i could put some more effort into aoki's room but honestly like i'm like such a girly girl okay i love the pink okay i love pink i love pink and most importantly is her little pictures and she has this uh board right here which she could add notes and stuff so it is functional um and then we have our luggage oh <laughs> I have two luggages of hers, but anyways. Um, and then here is her makeup station. She honestly does not wear a lot of makeup. She just wears a little bit of blush, for real, and a little eyeliner. But she has also some Dove sprays and some lotion. And yeah, and then also her pictures of her best friend. Uh, I'm gonna miss Naomi so much, but... Yeah, we're definitely going to have to go and visit her. And then here is her bathroom right here. Of course, got to add the eye roll because she has so much attitude. She is definitely a character. So this is her bathroom. So I would show you guys the the whole apartment um, like complex like down here and stuff. But I do want to check the little agreements and stuff. Girl, you are so loud in my eardrums right now. I'm going to view... The okay, so we have like two... Um, we only have one more vacancy that we could do, um, cause the other ones are filled up already, and we also already do know who the tenants are, which is Aiko, um, Aran, there's also Jack, Jeffrey, um, Maylee, and May, so... They're not all in the same household, by the way, um, but I just said everyone's name that we do know. Tenants will be prohibited from having TVs or stereos on between 10 p.m. and 6 a.m. Beware, Sims love to enjoy loud music or television, so this might make it for an unpopular property. So, let's be for real. Everyone is going to watch their TV, have a little, you know, loud music and stuff. Aoki is so 
so picky about things and she wants it to be her way or no way. Maximum occupancy, so two's a crowd, three's a party, and four sims in one house will violate the maximum. And also there's no trash overloads. And we also do have a far a four star rating already because the size of the apartment is very large. Um, we have some really good um, appliances and beds and stuff like that. We also do have a good environment, which is very fancy, but our maintenance is poor. So we're going to have to fix that. Um, our lease length is seven days, which makes sense. Um, and our rent is actually $255. The max rent that we can do is $510. I think we did do a lower um, rent for this family just because, you know, they have a little toddler and she felt like being nice. <laughs> so... <laughs> So yeah, those are honestly like our little agreements. So for her, you know, goals and stuff, she wants to handle a maintenance event. She also wants to perform an inspection pass. So we're definitely going to be getting into that. It is 8 p.m. right now. Um, I feel like um, Aoki is going to go ahead and probably make some dinner, even though they literally just had a little snack, but we're still going to make something. Honestly, I totally forgot that we had the rice cookers like how could i forget that in the morning i will actually um you know show you oh my god that finger just literally scared the hell out of me so we are going to make oh we can make so many different things a nasty lemon i think i'm saying i don't know if i'm saying that but um nasi and lemak rice coconut milk pandan leaf lactose free oh we're gonna make that okay we're definitely gonna make that our mom needs to teach us a little bit more about the culture honestly we don't really know too too much about it and i feel like we need to definitely know more about it oh my god my baby needs to go for a walk is she gonna go and ask her for a walk ask the list wait what you're gonna lick her face Oh, she gonna kiss. Yeah. Give her a kiss. Yeah, she needs to go outside. She is so sad, y'all. See, she is so sad because she's all cooped up inside. She needs to go outside. So we're definitely gonna go in and do that. I did not see how the rice cooker actually makes. Oh, is it done? Wait. Oh, it's not done yet. Okay. That's so cute. Okay, come on, my love. We're gonna go downstairs. Oh! Nyla! You paid on my new car. Oh my gosh. She paid on the. Oh, hell Is she no. playing in it? Oh, this dog. This dog. Girl, stop playing in your- Oh my god. Do we need to- Do we need to lecture you again? Miss Lady. Oh my goodness, y'all. So we can release Steam Vent. I don't know what this does, but we're gonna do it anyways. Wait, what even happened? Oh, does that like mean it's ready? Okay, well, we're gonna- Oh no, she didn't see so- Oh, gosh. Zanea is not talking to her mom right now, as you all can see. I cannot believe she did this on my new carpet. On my new carpet. Chihuahuas. They tell you something about them. So let's call to the meal. Tell Zanea that, you know, our dinner, well, the dinner is ready. Oh my god, we're having dinner at 10 p.m. <laughs> this was not supposed to happen. So Nyla is friendly, a vocal, and very playful. I don't know. I love her, but why would she do that? Why would she ever? <laughs> okay, let's go and put this, because for some reason she cannot get to it. So we're going to grab a serving. My gosh, she's so sad. Like, let's see if we can cheer her up. Let's see if Aoki's going to cheer her up. All right, so we're going to grab some of this. Oh, she wants to chat with her cousin. <laughs> Poor girl, she's so sad. She's gonna get an espresso macchiato. Does that say espresso macchiato? I think so. All right, so she's... Uh <laughs> oh my God, what is happening? 
Oh, I thought she was ripping up the furniture. I was about to say. I was about to say. You were gonna hear it from me. Oh, she likes fitness. Okay, cool. Um, one thing that she did want to do is she wants to leave a note for someone. So I wanted her to write a note for Zanea. Zanea just... She has an attitude. And she's honestly her own person. Like, she has her own little personality that she discovered. And she just has a little, a little attitude. We're gonna move our little suitcases over here. And try and write a note again. Okay, maybe not. Maybe it's too... I think it's too high. Oh my god, it is. <laughs> is this too? Is this still too high? Why are they so short? <laughs> oh, she's gonna ask her for advice. Anger management. See, what did I say? She is like honestly her own person, her own little attitude in her own world. Sometimes I just get so angry that I don't know what to do with myself. So how how can I deal with things when I can't even do a workout? Oh my god, that's the only answer that she has for her. A yogi offer listening ear. Wait, I never seen that before. Wait, is she gonna go and do it? <laughs> oh, she's so sad that she honestly like Nyla's the only thing, the only like person, <laughs> even though Nyla's not a person, but you know. <laughs> Chibana Duva. Oh, now she's being the supportive mother that she's supposed to be in the first place. Okay, so it says feeling heard, um, validated, and appreciated. Negative emotions are slipping away. Nice. This is what I mean. Okay, you need to try and make it better. Okay, we're going to go and um, put this in our inventory. And we are going to go and take a shower and really just go to bed because I want to do some inspections tomorrow because our maintenance is poor apparently. So we're going to go take us a quick shower and we're probably going to watch a little movie, have a little movie night with ourselves, you know. And we're going to watch What I Still Know, What You Did Last Summer. Zanea's already going to sleep. Is she napping? Girl go to bed we didn't do our little skincare or nothing tonight but we'll try and do it tomorrow all right my girl is very insecure insecure because she is ashy so let's go put on some lotion girl you got your lotion right here she's gonna be in her towel okay <laughs> okay whatever you decide whatever you decide where is Nyla? Oh, she's... <laughs> Did y'all hear her little snore? <laughs> that is so cute. Why am I so in love with that? What the heck? Anyways, we're going to sleep. We had a little bit of fun, so that's good. Let's go to sleep. Also, I do want to let you guys know... Um, we are going to be planning on having a little pool party with all of the tenants and to get to know them a little better and to just have a little bit of fun, you know. So we're going to um, do that. I need to also do auto lights. Um, we're going to do auto lights. All lights. Okay. Nyla, baby, what are you doing? Get comfortable. I'm so in love with Nyla. Like, I really am. Like, she's honestly, like, my favorite dog ever that I've ever had. Okay, ever. What are you doing? What is she doing? So, it's 7 a.m. in the morning. She is not ready. <laughs> she went back to sleep. Oh, she went to go cry. My boy girl went to go cry. Oh my gosh, I feel so bad. I feel so bad. Honestly, we're gonna have to just like not go to school for a little bit because like I just can't have my girl go to school right now. Like it's just not like it's just not gonna work. It's not gonna work. So we're gonna go and just call in call our little principal because you know our mom not gonna do it, so we're gonna do it ourselves. And we're going to go take a shower. Let's try and make today a better day. So we're going to brush our teeth. And we're going to give ourselves a little pep talk. Uh -oh. 
And a fall. <laughs> Rosie. Kaploni, you boy. Zappalapleva. Habari. Grapesa. I feel like the only way that she's really going to, like, get over, like, all of this is literally going back home. <laughs> like, oh, my God, what is she doing? Is she just waiting for her? Girl, you have your own bathroom. Go and brush your teeth. My Sims didn't do anything social for 24 hours. That sounds like me. We do have some skincare stuff, but they're actually supposed to be in our tote bag because we brought a lot of stuff over when we moved but i'm gonna bring everything back oh my god our candle let's put that right there that's cute and then we also have a little camera let's take a little picture it's, you know all right so after we're done that did she take a shower already well i mean she did take a shower last night so we're gonna go um use our little facial wash oh my god girl your arms <laughs> they just oh <laughs> damn girl <laughs> okay let's go in here my love my girl go and shave them hair legs real quick for me all right um and zanea oh she is all ashy let's go back in your room girl you are not done getting ready Let's go and apply some lotions, and we're gonna use our little deodorant. And I did want her to actually go downstairs and formally meet, you know, um, the tenants and stuff. Um, I do want to show you guys the um, area right here. So we have a little like cafe, which there's actually nobody here, which we need to hire somebody. But it's so cute. Like, look at this cafe. It is so adorable. I'm gonna leave um, where I got this apartment um, and down below. I did change it a lot though. Like this whole pool area was not here before. So um, yeah, but there's also an upstairs area where we can just chill, play some ping pong. And look at the view from here though. If I had an apartment that, like, do you know how calm and relaxed I would be? Like, I would be so happy. I would be the happiest girl alive, okay? <laughs> Here we have the laundry um, area. And what we could do, we don't have any laundry right now, but we could bring our pamper, like, downstairs, yeah. literally, um, to do some laundry and stuff. So that is a fun little feature that they added. Oh, yeah, I wanted to write a note, and I got distracted. All right, girl, you're not going to wear this outfit again, girl, please. Change your undies. Oh, we could also add a cleaning schedule. We're going to set our curfew. Her curfew is going to be at 9 p.m., okay? She is not allowed to be out later than that at all. Okay, now we can do it. She's going to add her little note. Poor Zanea. Oh, I wonder what the note says. Girl, put on some lotion. She's always complaining, and she can literally put on lotion if she wanted to. Did you wax your legs? I mean, they're not showing. She did. <laughs> she know the trick. She know the trick, okay? And they're chatting. What they chatting about? She's feeling very playful. A friendly voice. When Zanea remembers that Sim's words, her goals become clear in her mind. Milestones. Oh, she got a new milestone? Wait, let's see that. Let's see that. Okay. So, adopted. Oh, made a best friend. Let me check your milestones. I mean, I think I already seen this. Okay, first. <laughs> okay, we, we know that. She had a baby. She fell in love. Oh, oh yeah. Her first love, I guess, was Xavier. And then she fell in love again with Elijah. And then she got engaged. <laughs> um. Okay, let's try... Invite to hang out. She also has her brother. Maybe we can invite her brother. Um, their oh my god. Uh, Neg to do the chores. You already on her. Offer comforting advice. She doesn't know what type of parent she wants to be. Okay, let's do an inspection and maintenance over here. Everyone's coming over. How? Oh, hi. I want to see her do a little inspection. Um, she also wants to go, um, give away some simoleons. Oh, because she is generous. Oh, we can definitely do that. Huh. I mean, she chooses when she wants to be generous. Let's be for real. 
<laughs> not the run. The run is killing me. All right. I didn't want to have a pool party, but it's raining, y'all. Why is it raining? I mean, we can just, like, introduce ourselves and talk to um, the tenants, like, up here or something. We can have a little gathering. We also have a drink tray. We could serve bubble tea. We could serve drinks, liquor, tea, some coffee. Okay, she's... The oh, look at this little interaction. Now, this is actually so cute. This is so cute! She's doing her little inspections. Okay, so she pulls out a little mechanical thingy. And we got this performant inspection pass. We also need to handle a maintenance event. Keep your tenants happy by attending to maintenance events when a maintenance event occurs. Wait, who's outside? I hear some people outside. It's the Lee family. Hey. Okay, so let's go and say hi. Okay, so her brother is down here. Exchange secrets. Oh, yeah, that's also another thing. Maybe we should. I mean, I don't really know him like that. But we could try. She is in the zone. She is so focused, y'all. Oh, the tenants are outside today, y'all. Oh, my God, girl. Oh, why is she so tense? Let's be a little friendly with her. I'm gonna give her some props. She seems like a little angry. Oh, she wants to be nosy. Learn about a sim. May pick a shuma. We'll be Afflin. Oh, I guess she's leaving. Okay. Well, I mean, we can go downstairs to everyone else. Oh my god. Okay, let's go and give you a bath. Cause like she needs a bath really bad. Oh, and she needs to pee. She's gonna pee in here again. Wait, who made this? Everyone's trying to. <laughs> Everyone's grabbing a serving. Oh my god. That is so sweet of them. Whoever did this, I don't know who it was. Um, where is oh <gasps> tenant rule violation two? Rokea Rockside has violated the no trash overload rule. The neighbors wouldn't be surprised if the whole building gets pets. Post fine remotely using the mailbox or prosecute fine directly to the tenant household to enforce consequences for their. Oh my god, this is so exciting for me. <laughs> Oh my god, where is the trash overload? Already y'all doing trash, and I was being nice, okay? I was making the, the lease a little bit, you know? And y'all still can't do it. Y'all still can't do it. I can't believe they violated a rule already. Okay, Zanea is giving her a bath. Where is, oh, so they're all up here? Or is it just, oh, it's just Jack. Hi, Jay. Oh, look at her downstairs. Okay, well, we're gonna have to call you outside. I'm not gonna get your wife. I'm just gonna get you. <laughs> so, oh my god, they're both listening to music right now. Where, 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 where are you? Are you at the hospital? Wait, what is this? Is this a store? Oh, he's taking a jog? Oh, I don't want to be mean. I'll wait till he comes back, I guess. We're just going to introduce ourselves. We can spy on her. Oh my god. Let do a little handshake. Nice to meet you. Oh my gosh, she needs to pee so bad. <laughs> what are they talking about? Chat with Jeffrey. So Jeffrey is the father of Aiko and also Jack. We're gonna use the washroom. And look at them talking up here. Look at them talking up here. Buster Bood Wafatun Rashim. Oh, they're leaving? Oh, they're leaving. Okay, well, alright. We're gonna go take my dog to, to walk, okay? Go for a walk. We're gonna take her for a long walk. She deserves it. 
I know, my love. You're about to go for a walk. You should definitely hire a staff. We're gonna hire a barista. I don't know who it's gonna be, but hopefully they don't look a mess. <laughs> I think I want to save the pool party for the next episode. Because this episode was really just, like, talking to everybody and, like, kind of, like, getting to know everyone. We need to put a sink down, like, somewhere down here so we can clean up stuff faster. Jeffrey! We are, we are engaged, okay, sir? We are engaged. Where are you going? <laughs> Where are you going? <laughs> oh, my God. Is he really going to come up here? He got in a little too comfortable. His whole household got a little too... Oh, you just come right in here. Did I invite you inside? Did she invite him inside without me even seeing? Because why is he well. just like, hi? Oh, We're going to yell at him. <laughs> We're going to yell at him. Why are you doing... So <laughs> why is she feeling flirty? <laughs> Okay, like, you just come in here just to play a game and then leave? Okay, she's about to- Oh, wait, no, girl. You need to go and do this. But let me make sure- Oh, my God, no. Go on a walk. Stop. Don't. Let's go here and we're going to tell him he needs to pay up. We're going to do a little handshake. Let's not be mean. Okay, I don't know what's going on on these stairs right now, but y'all need to get it together. Stop. Oh. Pomeray. Prosecute fine. Fine for no trash oh, overload. Crazo. Yeah, pay up, sir. I know what you did. I know what you did. Yeah. Give me that money. What he said? He didn't wanna wait. Courtney, I can't see what you said, to be honest. <laughs> we need to change our little um Did he refuse? Trencherous tenants. Aoki's tenants were playing fast and loose with the rules, even ignoring a polite request for fair compensation. They must think this agreement is a joke. Oh, girl, they take you as a joke, girl. They take you as a joke and you're just gonna walk away to get some food? We're gonna yell at him. Girl, this is not the way to talk to your tenants, but we're gonna do it anyways. Today. You guys, this is so bad. This is so bad. This is so bad. Oh my God, girl, do not be flirty. Yeah. We're prying for it to, to know his secret. Let's let's see one of your secrets. You still didn't bring her. I discovered that Iron has this secret. A hopscotch hooligan. <laughs> oh my god, what? All of the kids in my neighborhood used to play hopscotch together for hours and hours. It got a it got way too competitive. Friendships were for uh forged and destroyed. Egos and sometimes shins were abused and legends were made. One day I was facing Henny, the most fearsome hopscotch opponents on the block i kept a watchful eye on kenny and when he looked away for a split second i fudged my hops a bit making it a little bit easier for me thankfully no one else noticed i ended up winning and becoming the new number one hot hopscotcher in our neighborhood and i was never dethroned i'm still proud of the title today no matter what i don't know what i'd do if anyone found out i was a fraud Oh my god. Oh my god. He has a grudge against us. Has a deep seated grudge against For what? For what reason? Like from Dova. Yo. Well, say. Oh my god, she is so mad, right? They have a, such a bad I did not think this is going to happen. He keeps yelling at us. Yo. Pay the fine or you're going to get evicted right now. Oh my god, y'all. He's laughing at us. Rumble, we're so. Oh. Y'all, he still does not want to pay this fine. We are going to just start yelling. Like, 
we're just gonna insult him just because xavier is calling to chat oh my god she's literally in this conversation oh my god we're gonna give him an another day we're gonna say tomorrow if he doesn't pay the fine and if he doesn't it's gonna be smoke sir we're probably just gonna call nyla over here and have her pee upstairs but for some reason i don't know if it's a mod or something in the game but like walking dogs is just so like not functional <laughs> at this point so we're just gonna go and ask her to potty real quick come outside and we're going to ask her to potty Maybe she can potty outside. <laughs> It'll dry up. Okay, the sun will dry it up. Oh my god, do not potty inside. Okay, where is she going? Oh my god. Is she going down? Oh my god, she's going to go all the way outside? Oh, she's so good. Okay, what was that conversation about? Was it happy? A friend's two cents. Being around a sim that cared enough to give helpful advice gives Zanea a burst of energy. Oh, she probably expressed to her dad how sad she's been. How is she gonna go order a drink? She is so angry. Aggravating conversation. She's also feeling very sad. Oh my god, what does this say? It's who can keep a secret so juicy and delicious? Secrets can be as sweet as ripe fruit. Does Aoki keep the fruit or sell it back for a hefty sum? She's definitely gonna sell for a hefty sum, okay? She is going to reveal that secret so fast. Xavier, Zanae, I just found out about this concert at uh, an abandoned warehouse. Oh, he wants to bring us to a concert. How cute. I wonder what, um coffee she's getting oh she's getting a little espresso that's cute okay get her a little espresso coffee 26 dollars do you know who my mother is she owns this thing okay she owns this thing are they gonna talk to each other probably not okay so nyla is um <clears throat> she is back upstairs so she can actually go and potty she is probably trained to go downstairs and also, I was teaching her how to lay down, so I do want to train her some more. Um, but I do still want to go on walks, and I don't know why it doesn't work for real, but she's going to go back upstairs and play a little. I'm going to give her some attention when we get back upstairs as well. Okay, she's about to go and finish her movie that she started last night. And we're cleaning this up right here. All the tenants, I think, are inside. Um... But I do definitely want to have a pool party in the next episode. No, girl, please bring this stuff upstairs. Oh, my God. Of course she would do this. <laughs> you know what? She's actually going to leave that there. Because she's like, you know, I don't even care. This is not my apartment. I don't want to be here. I'm not on good terms with my mom. I can't believe she did this to me. I'm not cool with... Oh, our aunt is here. Courtney. Hey, girl. This is Courtney, y'all. She is a foodie. She's a child of the village. She's a slob, loves the outdoors, and she's also very peaceful. And she is a massage therapist. So that's a little, you know, fun fact about her. Kind of late. We can just ask her how she is. I'm not really that close. Um with her actually we are pretty light close but um we're gonna come over here and just ask her how she is or how she's doing give her a little family kiss even though she's so angry she's stomping and everything she wants to give away simoleons one thing about corny is that she is not really like on she's not middle class and she's not also like high class either she really like struggles with like um money and stuff like that and so i think we're going to oh give to family two thousand dollars yes let's go and give her two thousand dollars because we're being generous she's like for me oh my gosh she said for me that's so cute gift of giving to family aoki has an insatiable desire to give away money to just about everyone especially to family definitely in good hands oh icky feeling from generous sim oh why did aoki say that being mean isn't her thing 
Oh. Oh, I shouldn't have done that. Okay, so she regrets being mean to Aaron. Let's hug her lovingly. What if she just came over to ask for somebody? <laughs> that would be funny. Okay, let's go use the washroom. Um, we need to get ready for bed. So, use the washroom. We're probably going to um, grab some leftovers or have a little quick meal of something. Because, you know, our mom didn't cook. I mean nothing new one thing about um zanea is that she loves her some cereal she loves her some fruit loops okay period we been sick nicole oh, i'm taking a picture oh, angie oh, <laughs> wait they look so similar they are literally like twins i also put this on simstagram oh, aoki's not really into like angie oh she wants some pictures for her own how cute Oh my god, wait, what? Well, we're gonna send her home because it is pretty late and we have to get ready for bed, so. Send her home. And we're gonna go and fill this bowl. Probably call um, Nyla to eat. I don't think she's hungry. Oh, yeah, she is hungry. Oh, she came. Oh, she's hiding under the couch. I'm dead. Okay. Read now. Okay, let's go and read the note. Let's finally read the note. Learn about a sim. Oh, we can definitely do that. And she wants to go to a vacation to Granite Falls. Maybe we could do that for like a little dad <laughs> daughter trip. Well, let's read this note. Oh wait, she didn't. She didn't like her craving a cup. Nothing. A cup of coffee wouldn't fix though. Oh, she is obsessed with some coffee. Okay, can we read the note? What does the note say? Oh, nice note. Aw, those notes were so Maya, sweet. Oh, that's so cute. <laughs> okay, that's cute. Alright, she about to go to sleep. I don't know when we're gonna actually feel appropriate to like really go to school and stuff. But honestly, it probably won't be for a little minute. For real. But... We're gonna go to sleep, y'all. We're gonna um ask Nyla to lay down so that she's not here barking everywhere. Uh, she wants to drink a glass of wine. You know what? How about we go and do that right now? Let's get, grab us a little bottle. Buy us a bottle of some alcohol. Um, we're gonna do a little Lamont. Okay, and we're gonna have a glass of wine and set the vibe. And then we'll end today's episode. And in the next episode, you guys, we're going to have our little pool party. And we're going to tell Aran he needs to pay up or he's getting evicted, okay? And we're going to finish our movie that we started last night as well. My gosh, this is such a vibe. Okay, so let's um turn off this light right here. Oh, who's she texting? Probably Elijah. Look at her living life. <laughs> Anyways, you guys, I'm going to end today's episode right here. I hope you guys all enjoyed it. Let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. What do you feel about Aoki and her relationship with her daughter? And what do y'all just feel about this Let's Play in general? I hope you guys all enjoyed it. And I'll see you guys in my very next one. Uh Oh my god. I'll see you guys in my very next video. Bye y'all.